Hello everyone, this is Aruna, Director of Great Brains. Today I came with the topic of speed reading. Let us understand what is speed reading. Speed reading is how fast you read the words. So generally when we pictureize anything, it is easy for us to remember. So we call it as a photogenic memory. When you see any picture, you capture many things at a time and you will be able to explain what all you saw. At the same time, you will be shown few words. How many words you will be able to capture? Very few when you compare with the photos. So we are trying to help the children to learn the words with photogenic memory. When you see the words, it registers as a photo to your brain. So we ask our children to read the words very fast so that they can remember these words as a photos, pictures. So this is called photogenic memory. We are here covering 80% of the words which will help you Whenever you see those words, you can pick up easily and you can say that sentence easily. So brain can transform these words as a photos and photogenic memory is very strong. You can pick up very fast and you can read very fast. Speed reading, if I am giving you any five lines to read, each sentence has 12 words. So if you are reading five lines in one minute, so that means your speed of reading is 12 into 5, 60 words per minute. So that is what the speed you have. So we are trying to increase that speed. So 80% of words we are covering as I said, 20% you are going to cover with your academics. As per the subject, you will pick up those words. Generally, our culture is reading anything by seeing and reading loudly and you read it as a by heart. You read, you see through your brain, your brain can collect that word but at the same time you read it from your heart too. Say like when we are, when we are very young, our schools are teaching methodology. They used to say A, A for apple. And everybody used to say along with the teacher A, A for apple, B, B for ball, C, C for cat. So that means you are capturing, you are listening at the same time, you are by hearting the words. So we generally do that even today. When we are reading, we are trying to understand and then we process. So that is when the speed gets slow. I will give you one more example. Say like you are driving in a car with your family. Your family is offering you some snacks or juice from backside to you. So you will take it when you are going very slowly. Relax minded. You are going very slowly. When you are driving, you are driving very slowly. You don't mind taking them and you are having them and driving. At the same time, when you are hurry. So do you think in that time somebody is passing you sweets or snacks or cold drinks? Will you accept them? No, you won't. Because... Your mind, your thought process, you are thinking to reach your destiny very fast. The same way when you are hurry, you want to do it. When you focus those words and when you read very fast, your concentration will be automatically high. Your observation will be automatically high. Your memory, your photogenic memory will be high. That is why we insist our students, the words which are given, to read them very fast. When they are reading very fast, automatically the speed will increase at the same time the photogenic memory will increase they can remember these words as a pictures so this is the whole concept of speed reading in great brains thank you